Welcome Capricorn to your reading, the urgent message you need to know right now. We're going to start off with the oracle cards to get the major messages and ideas coming through and then I'm going to clarify and get further insight with the tarot. If the messages that come through don't resonate with you, not to worry, it's just not your reading at this time and you can go ahead and look at your moon rising and Venus signs as they could have more relevant information for you. Right my lovely Capricorns, let's see what we have here for you. So the first thing that's coming through for you from Gaia is your physical body. So everything around the physical body, this is quite an important message. They want you to know, please take care of your physical body because it's the only body you've got at the, this time around. And if you look after your body, your body will look after you. That's eating well, sleeping well, spending time in nature, you know, spending time with people you love, whatever that is, just to nurture and take care of your physical body. And we'll see how that plays out into with, with the tarot cards. And then the next message we get is discipline, okay, with the master teacher. And this is a number 33, so it's quite a strong number. So there's some area in your life that perhaps you need to be more disciplined. It could be with your physical body or it could be some area completely separate. We're going to look at the tarot around that. And discipline just means, of course, giving it more time, dedication, attention. But let's look at the tarot so we get further insight into that. Right, let me go ahead and pull some tarot for you now. My lovely Capricorns. Let's see what this is all about. Okay, we'll start with this line. We've got the Four of Wands, we've got the Eight of Swords, the Six of Wands, the Five of Pentacles, the Queen of Pentacles, and the Hanged Man. Interesting. Right. All right. So let me have a quick look here and I'll tell you exactly what is going on here, Capricorn. All right. I think there is, um, for a lot of you, there is some kind of situation that you don't want to look at what's going on. There, perhaps it has to do with your physical body. Perhaps there is something you need to take care of in terms of the physical body. It's like, um, just say for example, you've got a toothache and you keep ignoring it and keep ignoring it and keep ignoring it and then it's gonna grow bigger and bigger and bigger. So there's something here that's just very interesting for me because it tells me there is an area of your life and it's not necessarily having to do with your physical body, it's just that the physical body came in. But there is an area in your life for some reason, and we're going to try and look and see what's going on here, you are not wanting to give it the attention it deserves or calls for. And by doing so, you're actually doing yourself a great disservice, Capricorn. It's like, you know, when you we just, you know, like just putting the blindfold on and we just don't want to see what's actually going on out there and you're just getting yourself deeper and deeper into a hole. Uh, this, I'll give you an example. Just say, for example, you um, money's a little bit tight and you start using your credit cards and you keep using it and you keep using it and you keep using it. Now, you know, you know, ultimately this is not going to benefit you and it's not going to do any good for you and it's not going to um, lead to good good things and you know actually the, the chances are it's actually going to lead you to be in a worse financial situation but for some reason and this is where the discipline is coming in for some reason you just are not willing or, or not able to see the wood for the trees at this time so the hangman comes in now and is just telling you that you just have to just to kind of take time out. Literally, just, you know, the hangman suspends himself from a tree so that he can get a, a, a better perspective and a better view of something. There, and this, this is where the discipline comes in. There is some kind of lack here of discipline. 
and the, the example I gave you with the, the finances of course it's going to be specific for each of you it could be you know something to do with relationships some kind of behavior some kind of addiction maybe cigarettes maybe food that that's harming the physical body there's something here that just requires you to stop and take a look and get really understand what is causing it what is causing you to ignore what's going on and and just like you know closing your eyes to the the situation putting this blindfold on and not acknowledging that what you're doing is actually getting you deeper and deeper into a hole okay so the me the urgent message that is coming through for you here is time out time out guys You've got to do something now just to really review what's going on and what's driving this reluctance to take control of the situation and be more disciplined and in, and in control. Because they're telling you, once you can understand what's going on here, what's driving it, okay? So it could be, okay, let's just, let me give you a random example. Um, say you are overeating and you're just absolutely eating loads of sugar and fast food and takeout and you're just absolutely neglecting you know the way you're eating and you're putting a lot of really not good food into your body there's obviously there's always right an underlying reason why you've lost the discipline and the focus to eating well so hangman comes in and says you have to understand what's going on and if that means reaching out to somebody talking to somebody guys it's really time to do it. The good, good news is, and I want you to know this, the good news is the cards are coming through as saying, as soon as you do reach out or get your get back into the, the position of control and understanding what's going on here and why you're doing it and why you're not being looking after this particular area of your life as soon as you understand it as soon as the light bulb goes on things are going to fall into place things are going to fall into place like, but not it won't it won't take like months or years things are falling into place quickly you get that focus and that discipline back you gain control of your life you gain control of, of whatever situation this is and look how lovely this is it tells you you know very soon your life goes back on track you 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 there is no doubt you will be able to get on top of it and come out as a winner a victor in the situation and you're going to have reason to celebrate there will be reason for you to celebrate okay so no matter what this is for you there is definite message is there is a way out you just have to find out what this is and guys if you're a little bit stuck you know just just reach out just ask somebody to help you because you don't want to just keep going deeper and deeper into into a dark hole here and there's going to be reason to celebrate really really quickly so let me take the little tarot for you to get an additional message for you at this time for our lovely capricorns and we've got the Queen of Wands, the Three of Pentacles, and the Three of Cups. Guys, this is very, very clear for me, okay? This is there, that you have a, a support team around you, whether you know it or whether you don't. There are people who love you, who people who've got your back, people who understand what's going on. They can see what's going on and they only want the best for you. This is really a time to reaching out people to, to your soul tribe, reaching out, getting a, getting a strong advice, strong direction. And I tell you, it won't take long. Like a light bulb, you have a light bulb moment and you'll get your life back on tra track quicker than you think. Somebody's going to come up with a great solution. You're going to speak to somebody who's going to have a great idea. And within honestly it's not it's just not a long period of time here that i can tell you just not a long period of time you won't even know yourself this will just be a bad patch you went through or just a, like this was just a wobble okay just a wobble where you kind of you know we've all been through such a period you know we, we all kind of left a little bit shaken and stirred of the last few years so this is just this could have been just a repercussion from that you know it could be financial anything emotional but please reach out, reach out to people you trust, people you value, um, a professional even, because as soon as the, 
you see it from a different perspective, you things are going to fall into place and you're going to get back on track very, very quickly. So there you have it, my lovely um, Capricorns. I hope you enjoyed your reading. If you did, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and give it the thumbs up. And I'm sending you all lots and lots of love.